It was a celebration of this sport, certainly. My name is Darren Sutton. Glad to have you back on campus, ASU Arizona. But in the end, a road victory for the Arizona Wildcats, and they improve what has been a very strong start to the season now, 9-3. and three. And you see some of the numbers and the differences. We'll talk about those blocks in just a minute. We've got to start by talking about Iman Isanovic, the junior who really has matured in her leadership, has matured in her ability to move past the next mistake, and she made so very few. She had 13 kills, she had 11 digs. She was huge out of the gates as that first set went to ASU. Then the Sofia Maldonado Diaz domination was fun to watch. It was defensively, it was offensively. She had five blocks, she had 11 kills. The sophomore, she and her team stepped up on both sides. She continues to evolve as an athlete. Her impact is huge. But then the Wildcats just built a wall and continued to shape this match with blocks. There were so many invited to the, the party. Merla Veit had eight. We talked about Maldonado Diaz. She had five. Hodge had a pair. Stuba, Puck Stuba with four. Emery Herman, the setter had four as well, 16 total blocks, just eight for ASU. And then in the fifth set, they just handed the volleyball to that talented athlete, the talented player, not too far found to the road, by the way, at Basha High School. Instead, she went to Tucson, not local. Jalen Hodge dominated, 15 kills overall, 17 digs. She had a pair of blocks, the super sophomore, along with Maldonado Diaz. What a bright future. It is a victory on the road at Desert Financial here in Tempe, Arizona. Again, Darren Sutton, thanks for spending time with all of us. More great volleyball in this amazing conference.